Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing very well. So I know coronavirus has pretty much cancelled Easter, but I still wanted to do like a little Easter sewing project. Hence these giant floppy bunny ears. They're so cute and fluffy. So in today's video we're going to be making these and a matching tail. And I've put my tail on a safety pin so I can safety pin it to any cute outfit I want. These are super fluffy, super easy to make. Um, if you like my channel and you like this video, please make sure to like, comment and subscribe. If you have another sewing video that you'd like me to cover, please comment down below. Feel free, I'm open to pretty much anything that's within my capabilities. And without further ado, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is pin down our pattern pieces and cut them out from the fake fur. I will be putting this pattern up on my Etsy store as soon as possible for anyone that wants to download it. Next we're going to pin our ear pieces right sides together and sew around the two long edges and leave the bottom open for turning out. You want to leave a little bit open on the side as well, it'll make the turning out process a bit easier. Realize that you didn't leave enough of an opening and struggle to turn out your ears as fluff flies into your nose. Because that's what happened to me. Next we're going to take our wire pieces and we are going to form basically a bunny ear skeleton armature and we're going to put that into the bunny ears and attach it to a headband. If 
if you find it easier to attach the skeleton of the bunny ear to the Alice band first and then slip the fur bunny ears on top of it, then by all means work away and do that. It's whatever you prefer to get the good position on the ears. Hot glue generously so that the skeleton doesn't move from the Alice band and it'll also help hold the, the fur bunny ears onto the skeleton a bit better. So use plenty of hot glue or E6000 glue or whatever glue you're using. Now onto your tail, so take two of your tail pieces, pin them right sides together and sew down the flatter edge and then do the same on the other two tail pieces and then you'll form a circle. Pin your two circles right sides together leaving a small opening to turn out and then once you turn your tail right way out stuff it.
Final step is to hand sew the opening of your tail closed and then attach a safety pin or whatever attachment you want to attach to your rabbit tail and you're done. So here's what the bunny ears and tails look like. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video make sure to like, comment and subscribe and I will hopefully see you in the next video. Take care guys, bye!